Hi, I'm Abby Stokes, the author of Is This Thing On? A Friendly Guide to Everything Digital for Newbies, Technophobes, and the Kicking and Screaming. In Chapter 21, Put It All Together, I promised that I would make a video for you about Dropbox. So let's talk about Dropbox. Dropbox is a website uh, that is to your computer the same thing that mini storage is to my apartment, which means Dropbox is where you can dump things that you don't want to have living on your computer. You can either dump them to save room on your computer, or you can put them there because you want them safely stored, or you can put them there because you want to share them with some other people. Before you open up a Dropbox account, you're going to want to have ready an email address that you want to give them so that they can contact you and you can use it to sign into the account. And you're also going to want to have a password. That way you're the only one that can access your account. If you're stymied by choosing a password, go to my website click on resources and under resources you'll see the words helpful guides. I've written a guide there called choosing a safe password. You may want to look at that before you choose your password for Dropbox. So once you've signed into Dropbox, what will open up on the screen for you is their homepage and up in the corner will be four symbols that I just want to decipher for you. The first symbol is an upload symbol and that upload symbol to upload something means to move it from one place to another. And what we're moving right now would be an item from your, uh, from your computer onto Dropbox's website. So that's what upload is. That's how you pull things onto Dropbox. New folder is the symbol beside that. And that means that you might want to create a folder system. You have so many things on Dropbox that you want to be able to put them into folders to organize them. The next symbol there is to share with the little rainbow. That means that you're able to share what you pulled onto Dropbox with somebody else. They won't see anything else that's on Dropbox or anything that's on your computer. They'll only see what you've chosen to share with them. And the last symbol, that little trash can, means delete. And of course, we want to have the opportunity to delete whatever we brought onto Dropbox eventually. Once you've brought something onto Dropbox, when you click on an item in the list of things you brought on, another menu opens up for you. And in that menu are several other symbols. Let's look at each of them. Download is the opposite of upload. So upload is you pulled something onto Dropbox's website. Download means you're taking something from Dropbox's website and you're putting it onto the computer that you're looking at in that moment. So download allows you to pull things off of Dropbox. Beside that is delete. So again, you can clean this up and delete anything that you no longer need on Dropbox. Rename allows you to go back and rename something that you brought on Dropbox because you may decide that the name you've given it isn't specific enough. Um, and the last item there is to move something. It may be that you create a folder system on Dropbox and now you want to move particular items into that folder system. Let's talk about pulling something onto Dropbox or uploading it to Dropbox. The first step is to click on the upload icon. After that, a window opens up for you and it allows you to choose from what's on your computer. So we choose files is the next step. And then we see what files we have on our computer. And after you've clicked on whatever it is you want to bring up, a photograph or a document, then you click on the word open. And the very last step is to click on the word done. And that will allow Dropbox to pull the item from your computer onto the website. Once you have items on Dropbox, you can access them, but you also can share them. And the way that you share them is you click on the given item, and then you click on the word share, which is off to the far right. And once you've clicked on share, a box will open up for you, a window, and that window actually has all this gibberish in blue. That's a link that will get whoever clicks on it to Dropbox to that specific item. So you have a choice. You can either fill in the form in front of you, putting in the email address of the person you want to send it to and a message to them, or you could just copy and paste that link from Dropbox into your email account and proceed to send them an email directly from there. And if you don't know how to copy and paste, that's why you want to get a copy of Is This Thing On and look that up and learn how to copy and paste because it's super helpful. Um, so to sort of bring this all back together again, Dropbox is a free website that allows you to store things or to share things from your computer, documents, photographs, files. If you have any questions, please feel free to email me and always come back to my site because I'm putting on new videos all the time based on what you've asked me for. So I'm just a click away.